little surface loop. How are you going to recover this once it's at the surface? <coughs> That's for Mike to worry about. Roger. <laughs> He's full of good ideas. We have lots of faith in Mike. Can you come up a little faster? Yep. I'm going to hold there a sec. Hmm? I'm holding there until you catch up. Oh. Coming up again. Yeah, we're really light. I'm coming up at 30. That's great. It's going to take us a while to get down. Yeah, might be going down it. Uh, I don't know. Let's find out. There's your 92 meter float. We'll see if the next float comes up at Is the ship going to be okay with this heading for recovery? You think? Weather looks pretty light. Yeah, um, I would guess that they would be staying here. Usually okay. they recover in whatever <coughs> position they've been hanging out in. Yeah, okay, so. cool. So I think once we cut this free... He we're might change his heading again because he had to change it just to make the transit down here. Yeah, but he has been sitting here for, what, half an hour or uh, an hour or so. Yeah. So yeah. the winds, the weather's pretty light. If he's cool with that, as soon as we cut that mooring, we'll start tracking a line. Okay. Just to get us away from the thing. Okay. Let me check. Bridge, nav. Maybe 45. Yeah. What time is it right now? 6.30, okay. Ooh. Whoop, bonk. Don't do that. Scraping the marine life off. Yeah, just clear, clean it up that section for you there, AJ. It's cool. Yeah, Mike doesn't want that on his deck, so. No, not that specific section. No. It does show up in sonar. It's a little pixel. Yeah, we're also out on a 50 meter range. Yeah, right.
There you go. Thank you. Do we notice what the depth was at the start? It was two two something. Two 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 zero. Okay, so we're at uh, two hundred meters up, and it's two twenty five. You say? I can't remember. Two fifty. Two seventy five. Oh, just terribly wrong. Or actually, 270. Okay. So 50, 50, 60 meters to go. Are you going to make watch Mike watch this whole thing so he knows what to expect? Yeah. Okay. He's watching. Oh, good. I'm pretty sure Joss is watching too from the lounge. We're going to try this super novel mooring recovery idea called using a winch. That's weird. I know. Never as, heard of that. as opposed to our strength, our arm strength, like in the past. Does that wreck the cables? Hopefully not. When we recovered the southwest on the Tully last summer, we did not hand bomb it. It was all crane. Roger. 1979. Which they just crane picked over and over? I believe so, yeah. 1978. There's your upward and downward facing ADCPs. Yeah, they're a little dirty. Yeah, can Don't we ask just me to sorry? Awesome. Nope. Can we just look at the rigging there? Sorry. Yeah, uh, can I do it on the way back down? Sure. Okay. It's like we came all this way, and that's like the one shackle we need to look at. Okay. <laughs> How much higher is this float? Hello. Uh, da, 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 swivel shakedown shouldn't be that far. This one now? Right there. Hello, orange. All right, yeah. Love to see that rigging. Yeah, roger that. Let me stop my ascent, and then I'll stabilize. OK, so Anything in particular you're looking for here? Just just what the it rope is. and the shackles, yeah. Okay. Just I can get go a zoom on them. A little bit them. around this side, then I'll have to come back. I don't think we really need to get around. Just a bit okay. of zoom, maybe. Sure. Uh, go ahead and zoom in, please. Try to do that. And that's good there. I'm gonna work yeah. my way down the sun kissed. And yes. Excellent. Good luck focusing. <laughs> I will do my best. When I get below, I'm going to tilt up on the camera just to see what we can see. Looks good there. We've got the poly steel recovery line, and then that AM steel looks like it's a bridle that will give us the center pick on that buoy. Happy there, AJ. I'll come down yep. a, little, a little more. Yep. Keep coming. Those shackles look shackles fine. Shackles look fine. Yeah. Still moused. Okay, come wide, please. Roger yeah. that. Pull on wide. And then let's just catch that shackle in between the ADCPs on the way down. Yeah, roger that. Come on down. Yep.
no reason to not follow it down too, so we know where it is and know we're not twisting around it. Okay, once we get stable, we'll come over to the ADCPs and we'll take a look. Yeah, and a right way up one. Oh my. So confusing. All right, video zoom in, please. Roger that, good for zoom. What do you think that distance is between the float and this ADCP? I don't know. Okay. Th whatever the difference is in the depth. Yeah. Did we take a note of what it was at the float? No. That's okay. your job? Yeah. Yeah. I'm busy trying to not tangle myself Fair enough. up in it. <laughs> I'm just wondering if it makes sense to pick this all on deck and only get the winch involved under the ADCPs. Shackles are looking good so far. Yeah. I can go a little around to the right, just to double check this one, but it's probably fine. It's so hairy. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like it's still mouse. Yep. Okay, happy there? Yep. Come Those wide, please. Good. Roger that. All right, so you can come down as quick as you are able. Quick as I can, roger. Full stick down. Yeah, minus 200% down. I'm probably going too fast. Not yet. Looks like we can do a bit more delta on the way down. Maybe something like 35 to 40. How's the hand cramp? It's fine, but nice. Yeah, forty looks really good in that tether. So before we set this free, I'd like to bring Atalanta south some more. Stretch it out as much as we can. Yeah. We'll get to the bottom first. Well, we could do a 
Yeah, let's just, let's just do one thing at a time. Let's, stretch, let's get to the bottom, stretch it out. Um, yeah, there is like a little bit of work to do at the bottom, so the yeah, ship Roger. can sort of be moving at Atlantic Clear while we're busy getting the carabiner on. Yeah, Roger. Carabiner on? Carabiner on. Yeah, you might want to... Mm, might make oh, sense to the, do that. Oh, uh, the USBL, I understand. Yeah. I think one of the best places to clip to it is going to be into the frame of the L box, which is our, our junction box that's on the bottom. I'm not 100% sure whether you can reach that while seated. Okay. So it may make sense to get the USBL while hovering and clip it in and then sit down to do the remainder of the work. Roger. We'll have a look before we touch down. Yep. Stop there a sec. Right. Is your altimeter just kicked in? Fifty meters off bottom. Can we have a step 10 meters south, please? I like how cozy that's getting.
10 meters off bottom. There's that crab. Look at him go. Gear. Five meters off bottom. Hey, AJ. Yes, sir. Can you point on the Telestrator thing where you want to clip the USBL? Yeah, well, I mean, anywhere that you think will work is probably good, but I was thinking we could clip it into that the corner okay. of that vertical threaded rod. Yeah, I understand. Okay. So anything below this assembly is not coming up. Roger. Set on them rocks, sir, maybe? Yeah, I think so. Do you think you can reach? Hopefully. Okay. I'll let you know once we fail. All right. Or succeed, I mean, that's what I meant to say. Yeah, one of them. One of them, yeah. Probably not both. Yeah, we can reach. It's nice Ooh. on the rock, doesn't kick up too much. Terrible seat sit down. Let me just bump it and get all tangled up. That'd be ideal. Try again. Here we go. All right, let me come up on arm hydraulics. Yeah, go ahead. Hmm. They're not coming on. Uh, press exit. Now you're good. Cool. Don't scare me like that, Dave. I just want to keep you on your toes, mate. <laughs> right, so this is round in the sample box again, yeah? Yeah, that's correct. Man, you guys just like making me go around there, don't you? Yeah. We just do it for the salvo. Yeah. <laughs> All right, arms live. And sample salvo, please. Thank you for saying it. Oh, you're most welcome, mate. Hey, Jay, make sure you note down that time so you can pull the audio later. Yeah. Roger that. Take a note. Turn it into a ringtone or something. Yeah, I'm gonna take an audio bite. <laughs> audio bite. For I don't remember what. Sample salvo. Say when you're ready. Uh, yeah. Who are you gonna hit with the bar? Oh. <laughs> Sorry. And it's that beacon just down there. Yeah, the big red. Oh. You can always regrip on your porch. Yeah, I'm um, trying to figure out how I'm going to get that clip off first. I don't know why they did that. No. They've clipped it in, or? Yeah, it's clipped on. With an open gate, I hope. Yes. I see just to the edge of the box. I guess that's maybe to make sure it doesn't accidentally clip into something else inside the box. Don't know what I could have clipped on. Stuff. Yeah, but you could, I mean, you'd be able to free it. Clip on the stem of a dust cap that was that would suck yeah we just send the dust cap up with it oh very nice
No, don't do that. Uh, hang on a minute. Why is that? Oh, it's because that's fully up, isn't it? Yeah, that's correct. You only got up in the wrist now. Yeah. That index thing is not good. Yeah, I got to do the index and give it a wiggle. Sometimes it takes four tries to get it. I think I'm stuck in here. Yeah, there we go. I'm just going to reset this arm mint. Roger. thruster is spinning very slowly. <clears throat> Can I close the box? Yes, sir, please. Tell me when you're ready for dive salvo. Yeah, go for it. Porch out. Yep, please. Whoop. Hello. Ah. Maybe I'll leave it. And if you need it, we can make it work, but I'll leave it for now. I got a lot more camera tip down. There's a lot more space there if you want it. Yeah, bring that. Yeah, rack out or whatever if we need to. Yeah, I'll, I'll follow your arm down as it goes down. Yeah. Tap. Video, can you come super double extra wide on Herxus? Roger. Thank you. Probably going to be ass about face for this, but we shall see.
we shall see. Cheers. I'll try and line it up on that threaded rod for yeah. you. Yeah. If I can find it. Yeah. Up is down, right? <coughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I'll line this one up too. Best I can. Okay. Stop it. That's a little bit. Can I get some zoom in there, please? Good for zoom. Yep. Roger, going in. Let me know where you want the camera. Uh, just center it up on that bar. That, that's good. Thank you. Right there somewhere. One bump right. There you are. <coughs> Come on. if it's going to make it because of that. The swivel? Oh, there you go. That's got her. Yeah. Nice. nice. Done. Well done. Right on. Beauty. Okay, video, come wide, please. <coughs> now just unclip that and clip it somewhere else. Yeah, clear yeah. off. <laughs> I'm done. Anything else that we need? Uh, yep. Okay. What, what's next? So, uh, we want to remove the receptacle, which is down here, mm -hmm. from the parking position, uh, so that Roger. it's hanging free. And then we're going to want to um, get our knives out and cut the double beaners knives that are out. holding this in place. Can I get you a bubble on preset one, please? You can see the double beaners there. Thank you. I think those are going to be pretty ugly cuts. <coughs> Do you want to go? Do you want to cut it? Oh, he's so kind. Where's the release? Was it up? Could I have seen that from where I was before? Yeah, I can show you the release if you if we look up. I keep landing on stuff. This is not my favorite. Spot. I, can, I can explain how it works so that you know you're not going to trigger it. Sure. Yeah, show me on the. That's the release there. I it's got see those zinc. Okay. Um, there's two poles. There's. Uh, a safety, which is just like a hockey puck with a bolt in it. It's on the far side? Yeah. If you nice. Can you go around that way? No. Okay. It's going to make this challenging. Mm. So the second release is this Delrin puck. Mm -hmm. There's like this white Delrin puck that you can see. Okay. That gets pulled down. That's the second release. There's okay. uh, a safety bolt preventing it from going down right now. Roger. So those are the two poles <coughs> of the release. Okay, let's go over here as far as we can. Get that uh, 
receptacle out of the A-frame and then snip the carabiner and then we'll reassess. Bonk. Okay, so we have two lines to cut and then a release to pull, is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Two lines to cut. There's yeah. two carabiners oh, here that are preventing that? rotation. It's the two white lines. There's yeah, one Roger. here, and there's one there. We'll do yeah, the, close the other one one's first. in quite tight and, tight and straight up. Okay, let's grab a knife, which I believe is on this uh, starboard bio box only. There's not one on the magnum, from what I understand. The one on the magnum is in the toolbox. In the toolbox up the, front. The ONC toolbox. ONC toolbox. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, the, okay. the naming of those things needs to change. One of them has to give. Isn't a tool basket? Yours? Uh, I don't know. We call it the toolbox. Oh, okay. All right, where are we going? Basket? Maybe it is. Starboard bio um, box. What we could do first before any of this is we can push this hockey puck out of the. Just get it out of that. Just up and out? Up and out. It'll slide right out. Just like it just unplugged, right? Yeah, you said that when you were going to unplug it. <laughs> It'll just unplug. Yeah, it's just, uh, just you like that. Can you just uh, unplug it? I think you've been pretty good about not saying just. I say it a lot. I don't know how not to. Okay. Just don't say it. I just won't. Yeah. Can I... Definitely gonna move the vehicle because I'm balanced on a single rock, so that's fine. Just uh, be aware of that. Just be aware. Just be aware. That's all I'm asking. Just. It's easy to be aware. Just slide out. He says that's a, that's stuck. That is stuck. It's huh. in there. <coughs> How much force can we give? All you need. Roger. It's got to come uh, out. Give me. If you need to reposition. I can't really go farther right because that would require a ship move. Oh, yeah. There she blows. Get the fuck out. Pardon my friend. Beauty. So, AJ, that's not going to catch the train wheel on the way up? No. Do you Definitely want me to pull it clear yeah, of the wheel? You, you can pull it clear, pull it right towards us. It'll sit on the ground. Yeah, Great. wonderful. Now we get Cuddy. Yeah. So that's going to be the starboard side box again, I think is our second knife. Is that true? Okay. Does anybody know? Not a clue. Do not know. I have a photo of the box of how we left it, which is not how it was it's left. It's not how it's going to be now. Of course not, but it's not nothing. What is this? Stop. Don't give me ads. Okay, it's in the... Yeah, there was one in the box. Okay. Yellow handle. Let's go have a look. It's on a monkey's fist. That'll help. Yeah. Coming around. Let's okay. have the yeah, sample okay. salvo, please. Yeah, you this here first. Oop. Come on. Come on. There we go. Sample salvo coming up. Let me know when you're ready for sample tray. Starboard bio box. Okay, <coughs> go for it. Who can spot the monkey fist? Found it. Is that it? Mm -hmm. In behind that parking position thing? That's not it. That's the T-Boss. 
Why do we bring down a T-Boss? Where's the other one? I'm betting it's uh, forward port, forward inboard. Is that it, just on the edge there? I think so. Not the black and yellow, but the thing that's just barely visible. Down here? Maybe, or maybe the one more forward, hard to say. Oh, hang on. Yeah, that thing. Yeah. Don't do that. That's it. Nice. Mostly blind grab. And the T-Boss for good measure. Oh, there you go. Great. <laughs> yeah, just for good. Just for flair. Something Box extra. In. Wow. Don't know how you saw that. You guys must have an extra camera up there. Yeah, we do. No. Ready? Yeah, go for it. Top. I don't know what that word is. You've said it a couple times this watch. I've tried to figure it out. I What's that? Top. Top is when you give things you. to people. Oh. And Cheers. That. Thanks. Nice one. Cool. It's a thing we say in New Zealand too. It's like when you give things to people. Top. Top. Cool. I'm learning something. Okay, now you get the fun job of cutting that carabiner. It's not gonna be so fun when that whole mooring it shifts over. No. Stop. Arms run off, mate. Yeah, Roger, got it. Okay. Uh, I turned off the valve here. Yep. All right. Uh, we're going to turn off craft power. Yeah, try it. And then we'll reboot it. I'll just keep it in a... Okay, I'm gonna turn the power on. Yep. I didn't like that rubber on the gas tight handle anyways. Let me know when you got comms, we'll try it out. Just saying no comms? Yeah, it takes a minute, gotta boot. Okay, there we go. Okay, I'll give you hydraulics here, which shouldn't do anything. Yep. And then you can go ahead and hit that button, and I'll be ready to kill it here if it does something funny. Yep. Ready? Coming up. Yep, go ahead. Looks good. Okay. Uh, hey, Josh. Let's see. Sometimes.
Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Yeah. Do we have another knife? Yeah, it's in the tool basket. We have the uh, hook knife, which is not very good for these lines, but we could try that out. Uh, where do we want to put this? Uh, toolbox in the front of the ROV. Mm -hmm. Yep, let me put this away. Yeah, I think that's maybe a last resort, but yeah, I think we might have to give it a try if the knife doesn't work. It's frozen. Hmm? Man. AJ, can I try and unclip the carabiner? Yeah, if you think if you think you've got it, then I go don't for have it. any idea if I got it, but I'm gonna give her gas. Sure. What are we doing here? Uh, just, you're you're good, Josh. Can Wait, I have a zoom, please? The second one is gonna be more challenging than the first, so. Second, oh the yeah the inside one. Yeah. Good there, thank you. The top side might be easier, might be worth looking at later, but go for this one. Roger. Sorry I landed you so sketchy there, Josh. Good luck. Uh, sure, it's all your fault. Yeah. <laughs> Seems fine. Oh, there's a bar in there, isn't there? Yeah. Can you line me up a little more, Josh? You gotta stop going to the bar, Trevor. I know. And then a little more zoom, please, video. Roger that. Looks like the spring might have toasted on it, so that's nice. It's a helpful treat. Okay, what's with your bar? I thought we were done with bars. Nice. That was a good one. Thanks. Okay, what? Oh, I'm already, oh, I got it, okay. Great, that's right where I started, that's fine. Everything's going to plan. Hmm, now it's noodly, that's fine too. Not big enough. Ah. Yeah, I'm out of there, Josh. Can you come wide, please, video? One wide. Out of there as I can be. 
Um, okay, I'm going to try it again if you're stable, Josh. I am. Okay. Uh, zoom in, please. Roger that. That's good there. Thank you. Yeah, these things got to be hose clamped to bars. Yeah, no kidding. Well, I think plan A was oh. to cut it. Sure, but still no excuse not to hose clamp it to a bar or the handle. That handle doesn't do anything for us. And that's called ROV whinging. <laughs> if you talk to Simon. Come on. Oh, missed. Try again. No, that's not going to go. I got to get it in the T slot. Come on, but also not have it stick to itself. Yep, get off of there. Okay. Get off of there. No, it's not going to go that way, is it? You try this one more time and then reevaluate. Roger. Just doesn't go, does it? Not the right angle for it. Well, unless I can push it on here. Just bend the gate, maybe. It's not that strong. Yeah, I don't have any more pen. No. Okay, right. I'm off there. Come wide, please. Go wide. Let's look at the top one. Oh, from from this side. From this side. Yeah, Roger, I see. Let's try that. Yeah, go ahead. Zoom in. Roger that. One of the problems is that the plate on the top and bottom are so thick. Good there? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. That it doesn't let the gate open. Yeah, agreed. And it's too rounded, so it's it so, just, it yeah. always slips Yeah, I'm giving up. Okay, come wide again. Pulling wide. Let's look at the top one, see if that's better off. Holy moly. Hello, buddy. <coughs> that was oh, that's tangled up in there, isn't it? Neat. Yeah, a cut. Yeah, I'm going to try to, another thing here. Can you look down at the train wheel again? Yeah. I'm going to try and grab the knife hand, or what is the thing called? Blade? Do we have more knives? No, the, uh, uh, no. Short Roger. answer. Understood. Short answer. We have... Uh, one hook knife, which is not serrated. Right. Please cut it like that. Yeah, good luck. You can do it, Trevor. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh... I want to set it up a place where I can... Well, grab it. Grab it better. But you know what? I have this in the grip now. No way to do this wrong. Oop, yeah, the halt button, right. I know about that problem. Okay, can you line me up on the knife, please, Josh? Then we'll get a zoom. There is going to be give to that line. It's not under oh, tension, I so. I'm going to be pulling it under tension. Yep. Zoom in, please. Roger. Good there. Hmm.
Ooh. Yeah, definitely oh, did that on smear. purpose. Fantastic. That was what I wanted to do. <coughs> That's the yeah. pr pro smear. <laughs> definitely not an accident. <laughs> you shouldn't. Almost all the way. Oh, yeah. Keep I going. I can't go any more right. That's fine. I'll just make it work. You'll just push the vehicle right? Yeah, I'll push Perfect. the vehicle. Whoop, don't cut in the new spot, Trev. Why don't you cut in the old spot? It's close enough to the old spot. Oh, no, it's not. All right. Uh... Hopefully. Come on. No, no, I got it. You're good. Okay. Okay. Come full well wide, done. please. Full wide. Well done, Trav. Thanks. For breakfast? Yeah. Or I'll go. Whatever you want. What do you want to do, Trevor? I'm, I'll stay here. No, I mean, where do you want me to be? Oh, let's uh, look at the chain in the middle. And it's got that line in it. I can actually stand by before zooming in. I'm going to non-knifely nuzzle that orange thing away. Okay, zoom in there, please. Roger. I see the line twisted around there, yeah. Okay, good there. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. That's slightly more under tension. Yeah. Also okay, come again. wide, please. Yeah. This one, I kind of want the knife the other way around. Full wide, super duper extra wide. Roger. Full wide. Okay, can I see the porch, please, Josh? Yes. Yeah, take your time. Can you brighten that up, please, video? Roger. Yeah, that's great. Thanks. Let's try this. Oh yeah, right, I forgot about that little lanyard. That was not my best work. Let's see what I can do. What happened even? Can you rack me ca my camera out? <laughs> what? I don't even, what even happened? It's springy sprungied. Bubble cam? It's not a bad idea. Appreciate that. It's easy to get tunnel vision here. And okay, Shepherd's Hook. Just what if you didn't exist right now? It's named after you. No. Man, I made that situation way worse. That's great. If you were putting it away to bring up, you did a great job. Yeah, almost. <laughs> Ready to recover. Perfect. Oh, man, if you slide it out underneath that way and then at the end is just hanging off the end of the porch. That's the dream, isn't it? Master. Mm hmm You said scratch my name on the porch? Is that what you said? <laughs> All right. This is not... My finest hour. There's, an, I mean, I don't think we have any plans to use the shepherd's hook. If you wanted to just no. remove it, I'm going to hope that the mud is deep. Yeah, Roger. Mud is deep, Roger. Perfect. And we've lost it. No. Temporarily misplaced, AJ. 
Oh, we've lost it. We found it. Temporarily yeah. misplaced. Okay, now I'm gonna do the old train wheel schmear. Cut not, the oily. Not the oily schmear, please. Cut the oily, Roger. Understood. Cutting oily. Um, yeah, I really, I need this to be the other way around. This is the problem. This is my original problem. If you get it s straight out, no, it's not gonna work. I want the serrations towards me. Yeah. You just drop it like that, gone forever. Okay. Oh my god. I can probably I see it double now. I wonder if the hook one will be better for this. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know where it is. It's oh, right, I know where it right is. Yeah. Right? It is that lanyard. Let's try it. I can extend more too. I'm good. Okay. You just clear that viz out for me. Thanks. On it. Yeah, I can't see. Can't see. <coughs> Can you zoom in, please, video? Roger that. Good there. Ugh, Fletcher. It's the littlest grab I've ever done. I'm no, that's not true. Is it buoyant? <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't that be a fun surprise? Uh, let me think this through here. I want to. I want it to be the opposite way that it is. So that's fine. Again, I want the cutty bit towards me, which is the nature of this entire problem. Oh my gosh. That might work in the... Let me just make it worse for myself, that'll be fine. I think he got, got something. It's something. It's work. not my p first choice, but it'll have to do. Okay. At the risk of having to re-grab, I'm going to not re-grab. Okay, uh, come wide, please. Come in wide. Yeah, I don't love this, but here we are. That uh, orange line's just in the right spot, so that's fine. Right, shimmy, you want um, uh, I think we can zoom past it. Go right ahead, right. zoom, please. Right that. <laughs> I saw you lean over there, Josh. <laughs> Jeez, I was trying. I'm trying yeah, to lean. It. Playing Mario Kart, buddy. Yeah, exactly. Okay, orange hose. AJ, why'd you leave it there? That's a good question. That's hilariously in the way. Unreal. Bubble. Working on it. Oh, that anode. Oh, okay, come gone, wide, please, video. Gone, so. Blown wide. And maybe a little less blown out now? Yeah, I do. Uh, it's, it's up to Trevor. Yeah, that's fine. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the non-serrated is not deluxe. Okay, zoom in again. Good there. Sorry, I should have said that earlier. Back out a bit. That. My fault. Yeah, good vibrator. there. Video, can you move that orange hose? You know, I don't think I can move the hose. Okay, roger. No, come full wide, please. I gotta full move wide. that orange hose. It's up in the. It's on the brow. Brow. Mmm, neat. Yeah, I'm not moving that orange hose. You can back away a bit, Josh. Okay. 
I'm uh, halted. Ready? Okay. Hey, I see the knife. No, I don't. There it is. That's great. Better? That's fine, yeah. What am I doing? Okay, zoom in, please, video. Roger that, going in. And good there. victim of my grip here. It's going a little a little back and forth. That way? <laughs> no, I know. That's not what I'm trying to do. But here I am, doing it anyway. You're getting it. It's going. Whoop. Ooh. You okay? Yeah, we're just, just bending it. I'm glad we got the rubber knife. <laughs> The knife is breaking. Is your spirit breaking? What broke what down? Just the, release? Can you uh, zoom wide, please? One wide. Unless the chain just pulled around. No, it's chain just pulled around, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is my favorite right now. Yeah, pushing this rope. There we go. Nailed Nicely it. done. <laughs> well done. <laughs> All right. Uh, any more cutting, or we can I desnip this in the box? You can put it in the box. Okay, front box. Roger. Yeah, never again with the carabiners. I feel like I might have clipped those. I don't 20, know why. 2019. On on here. On this ship? I don't know. Maybe. I mean, I understand why it was done. You don't really have much choice if you can't get the pin through. I don't have much choice. I just work here. No. I don't have any choice. You run the show. No, I don't. Just do what I'm told. Just a bus driver. Okay. We got some cut things. Okay. So, all that is left is releasing the mooring. Okay, so can we, in this position, see anything about that? I'm going to stow this arm for a moment. Uh, like about the pull pins? Yeah, just let's get a good plan here before we just go ahead. You know what I mean? Yep. So you said there's a thing that you pull to get the bolt out of the way, then you pull yeah. the other thing. There should be a puck on one side. Um, it's, really hard. it's really hard to see from here, but there should be a puck on one side of this assembly that has a bolt attached to it. And that's your safety bolt. So, you so pull, pull the puck? So you pull the puck out. Yeah, you just pull it away. Okay. And then the second pull is the Delrin. It, it's kind of like a oval-shaped piece. It's pretty obvious. It's white. It sticks out on the side. And you okay. pull that down. That'll pivot down, and that'll release. Okay, roger. So it looks like they're all on completely the wrong side, which is perfectly fine. We're going to figure out a way to manage that, and then also be still clear of it when the uh, thing flies up. So not having the... Uh, receptacle under the brow, for instance. Mm -hmm. Agreed. Uh, we also want to, once we get a position that we can position the vehicle in, before we do any of those actions, we'll make sure Atalanta is as stretched out as possible. So I guess first step is figure out where the thing is, what it looks like, and what orientation the vehicle has to be in. Here we go. Isn't Atalanta to your right? No. To the left. Atlanta's pretty much due south of Herc right now, so coming to behind Hercules. Oh, I was looking at the wrong, yep, I was looking at the wrong thing. Are we seeing the things we got to see yet, AJ? 
Uh, the second pole is really obvious. It's this white puck. And that just flops down to the left? Yeah. Okay. And I see a puck above that, I think. Or is that, am I... Mi no, I'm worried that the safety puck is on the other side. Okay. That would be because of this sort of dangly pin. That's a, that's different from the safety puck. Dangly pin, safety puck. Yeah. Can I spin this thing? You sure can. Okay. We found that, yeah. <laughs> so if I can spin it, then we can make sure we're looking the right way to bug out. I can't, I can't guarantee it'll stay spin when you let go of it. No, I understood. We're looking a pretty good way, Trevor. Yeah, I think that looks fine. Um, if I can spin it and we can stay in this position, I'm happy here. Stand by. Standing by. Uh, um, well, uh, okay, go for it. See okay, what going for it. Standing by. Let me know when you're happy. I'm going to bring Atalanta's heading around okay. so it's facing away. Give you a little more slack and then we can get it out of the way. Good enough for me. I'm just going to bump this thing, Josh. Okay. If we it. get some zoom on this, even in its current orientation, we might be able to sort of see where that puck is. Okay, I'm halted. Please zoom. After that. Call it out if you need it, Josh. Oh, that was a good hit. Nice. Oh. I see the white lever. Yeah, so the pin is going to be like, oh, where? I see is chain, it? I see nuts. Yeah, one of these bolts coming through is a safety pin. It's got a nut on it? No, shouldn't. Okay. All right, let's look at the other side. Okay, come wide, please. Pull in wide. You're, if you're still good there, Josh, I'll nuzzle this around. You yeah, don't, uh, I'm pretty sure as soon as you fire up, we're I wonder if there's no safe. safety pin in this one, because I think I found the hole where it should have gone. Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, that's just the top. Great. Everything's fine there. Yeah, the bottom's gonna be tougher to spin. So if I if I doink that white thing down, it's just gonna go away. Eh? It may. If we get can we get some zoom again and then I can just I'm ready if you're ready, Josh. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. Go for zoom. I think that this hole there is where the safety pin typically goes. Okay. So yeah, I mean I think we could try the Try the release. Try the release and be prepared for it to go. Okay. Uh, I think we should move the ship, I don't know, five to 10 meters south. Okay. Let's do 10 meters south. Okay. And I'll pay it on Delta. Bridge, nav. Can we move one zero meters south, please? Thank you. And Lynette, I don't know how you want to manage that, but I think as soon as this goes, let's track, line track south. south. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know if you want to have the bridge on standby for that or what, but uh, yeah. Okay. We're not going to dodge it with the vehicles; it'll be gone. But uh, just get the ship out of the way. Right. Okay. <clears throat> and then we'll immediately come up. Bridge nav. Um, we are getting ready to release the mooring. As soon as we do that, we'd like to track a line forward um, a couple hundred meters. Um, stand by for that. I'll let you know when we're ready. Um, maybe 0 0.5 knots? Sure. Perfect. That's Thank fine. you. Okay. Um, ship move is pretty much ish, complete ish, halfway. Um, Let's give it a minute for Atalanta to go yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. We still have 
seven meters left on a 10 meter move. So. Oh, okay, Roger. Yeah. Is it, you see that blue rope? Yep. Is that attached to that little chain? Yeah, it looks Is like it. Is it worth lifting that over the other side Probably, of this? Probably, yep. Yeah. Probably. I mean, it'll go with it. Yeah, unless it gets stuck on a bolt. Unless it gets stuck on a bolt, yeah. No, the, I mean, it'll still go with it. Oh, it releases the chain. Doesn't so the, the actual right. release unhooks down there. Okay, understood. Okay. Could you come wide, please, video? Roger that. Just wide. Little, well, just come out a little bit and keep going. I mean, uh, good there. unless being hooked there will prevent the Delrin puck from coming down, but I don't know. I think it'll I, still I go. I think it's good. So the only other thing that's dangly is the USBL, which will probably clear, and the connector, which will probably clear. Yeah. So I think we're set. As soon as we see some Atalanta movement, I think I'm ready to go. Okay. Should be pretty obvious, eh? Anything I'm missing, Dave? You see everything? I'd see what you want to see. That is yeah, the hole that we saw. Yeah, okay. okay, thank you for checking. Clip it down and be ready to bail out. Yeah, Roger. Yeah, it is. It is, yeah. At least it's going to be gone from Herc, so there's no quick moves needed from Herc. We're just yeah. trying to move the ship out of the way of it hitting. And are we getting beacon hits on that, uh, the beacon that's attached there? I have not been getting beacon hits, but... Uh, the vehicle's kind of right over it again, so okay. I don't know that we will until it's released. Starting to see some Atalanta movement now, maybe. <coughs> sorta. Sorta, noise. Yeah. <laughs> What's the estimated time to surface on this thing? 20 minutes? 20 minutes. Whew. Jesus. This thing moves. Yeah, that's... Uh, so that's motoring, that is. That is really fast. Wow. Need to get some video cameras set up outside it's for gonna, the breach. It's going to breach, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Someone can tell me where it's going to come up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nav, this is video. <laughs> <laughs> um... Yeah, okay. I'm getting impatient, but I should just, just wait it out. Just let, let Atalanta move. Patience, grasshopper. Yeah. Beautiful day for a recovery, though. It's kind of a mill pond out there. Couldn't ask for a better day for moorings. Apart from the three knots are current. Now we're getting some action. I saw that. Yeah, the we're, vehicle. Getting, we're getting gonna a quite old tweak. Yeah, I'm going down on Delta. I gotta go to about yeah, 20. No worries. It's good. That means Atlanta's moving. <coughs> yep. <coughs> oh, she's moving, okay. Okay, I'm gonna stop on the winch. That cable's not going with it as well. The orange it? cable is going with it. So let's come wide video. Yeah, right that. where's that oh, running? Make sure it's not up into the brow. Okay. Do you want to look at your brow? Just make sure it's clear. I'm sure it is, but yeah, just be really sure. Yeah, I think we're good. It's uh, pretty close, actually. That light is shining kind of right on it. Maybe we ought to back away a bit. The cables around the other side. Cables around the back of I'm it. I'm looking at it? the I'm looking at the black plastic, yeah. orange thing holders. Yeah. That might bonk us on the way up. Maybe not, but I don't know. I don't want to find out the yeah, hardware. Soon. I got lots of reach on this arm, Have so you? I'm right. shoulder completely up. So you got you got room to back up a meter or so. Yeah. See what we can do with these rocks underneath. Yeah, understood. I'm gonna get here and I'm halted. Yep. It would just be a very bad day if it hooked on Herc. I 
like that, what you're doing there too, Dave. Put it off to the side to kind of mm. kitty corner to it. Keep it out of the brow. Yeah, get the most arm reach. Let me know if I can take bubble. Yeah, go for it. I think we're clear enough there. Maybe. Yeah, I like that. Once you got her locked in steady, I think we'll... Yeah, that might be another story. Yeah, of course. Hopefully that's... Uh, not too far, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I don't know if I can make that work. No, I'll come back around to touch. Okay. Try that. Roger. I'll start getting close. That's probably full right. Yeah, it is. Okay, video, can you please zoom me in, but keep that white toggle thing in focus? Roger right that. In view. Yeah, good there. Where am I? That's the threaded rod right there. Okay. Okay, we cleared a release. Atlanta's gone south. Back row's happy. Okay, you happy, Dave? Yes, but Kay. I think we're going to lose viz on you real quick. Let's try so. it. Ain't nothing for it but to do it. <laughs> hey, Jay. Keep going. Keep, holy you got you to get it all the way over. Holy moly. There you go. There she's gone. Okay. She's gone. Bridge yeah. now. And we're clear on now her. We're Come clear. full wide, please. Full wide. We're ready to track that line forward. <laughs> Thank you. Peek it away, 14.55. Great job, folks. Thank you. Whew. Thank you, team. That's five minutes early. That was what awesome. You, what are you thinking? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's uh, do some recovery action. Coming up in the winch, nice okay. and slow. We'll We're ready come to off come off bottom. Yeah. Okay. Just gonna let her drift up, come clear. Yeah, Roger. Have a look back around at the site, make sure we're good. <laughs> Things half triggered. <laughs> AJ, what have you promised me? We're good. Yeah, right on. Um, how far has the ship got left to move? Um, I just, we just put in like hundreds of meters, so we'll stop whenever you want. Okay. Yes. Uh, or where can I see it? Us. Can we see it on? on oh, is it the red path? one? No, we won't see it. We won't see it here. Okay. It's in high pack. I'll pull uh, up high okay. pack. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty much right above us. Right above us. That's neat. Neato. Mm -hmm. Where am I looking on high pack? Uh, it's the fish symbol here. Oh yeah, we gotta get the heck out of here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've just sped it up now. I don't want to stretch out yet. Mind you, I'm, I'm good to stretch out anyway, but... Quick wash change of video.
bridge nav. Uh, we're coming up off bottom right now, about one hour until we are at the surface. Um, not yet. We'll keep moving for now. I'll let you know. Thank you. It's going to be more than an hour. It's going to be... Two one nine six. Actually, no, it's not far off. Seventy five minutes. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Ah, <coughs> uh, too slow right now. He's just slowing down while I call up. So it looks like the mooring is coming up more or less right above us. I don't know if we want to stop on coming up and just keep running south for a yeah. while before okay. we come up. Okay, can do. Come on, stop. Yep. Yeah. I can come down if you want. There you go, bang on. Two meters. Just keep, that's good. Keep us level. Yeah, the ship yeah, is moving point. south, so I'm hoping we can outrun it to the south and then keep coming up to the surface. Because um, we're here, Atalanta's here, the mooring is right here. It's not that much above us. But it, is above us. it is above us. Yeah. But it's coming with us yeah. instead of blowing away like they thought it would. We can speed the ship up, I guess. Uh, uh yeah. So was the ship's doing half a knot, isn't it? Yeah, we're doing half a knot now. We could maybe try to do one. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's uh, 500 meters above us now. Okay. So that's good. Where is it position-wise in relation to us? Is it coming closer to the vehicles or? Um, so it's pretty much like right above Herc right now. Okay. Um, it is trending south, but not as fast as we are. Okay. okay. Um, should we speed up to one knot? No. You want to no. go to one knot? I don't know. We did it on the transit over. Okay. Have you got your head in hold in on Atalanta? Don't know. Do you have like a mon left button? Hey. <laughs> mm -hmm. There you go. Uh, uh.
hanging out, we're not ascending. I'm going to come back down to you. It's okay, stay there. I'll come down to you, mate. Two hundred and seventy meters. It's not going that fast either. Sorry mate, I hit yeah. my fault. I hit auto heading. Ships miles away, yeah. Uh, dead south too. Um, I, I would hope not as far as speed goes so we can get the vehicles on deck and then get the mooring on because uh, mooring is just going to be bobbing at the surface, but I, I agree. But when we dove last night, yeah, what was that? somebody said, oh, we're not doing on the descent. We're doing on the ascent. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Doesn't say that in the dive plan. Excellent. Does, does not. Good. Just, unless. Okay, yeah. Um, okay, M Mr. Rennie? Yes. Are we good to keep coming up? Because we've stopped to make sure we're well clear of that moment. Roger, yeah. So uh, the mooring is now 35 meters north of Hercules. Okay. So. And way above us. Yeah. 
All right, we're gonna come up. Yep. Yep. And in yeah, in order to get into proper recovery, we'll have to kind of flip everything around, Hercules-wise. And yeah, that'll be interesting because we'll have to not run into the mooring when we. What do we need to turn around? Uh, the ship's current. Oh, sorry. Ship's we're heading good. is south. Yeah, yeah. Just did not see that. Yep. Yep. Yeah, all good. good. All good. All good. Sweet. That's flipped from before. Yep. Good, thank you. Okay, mate, coming up. Roger. Aiming Man. for 30, 30 meters a minute, yeah? Yep. Yeah, I hope you get tugged soon because we're pulling w way south. Yeah, I mean. There's no obstructions, even if you guys are not coming up. You know, we're kind of running oh, along we're on contour. The way up now, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But also, I guess at your discretion, feel free to stop the ship move too. Raj. The moorings really just trying to north or straight up. Yeah, it's kind of like still just sitting there, to be honest. I'll wait till you guys come up a little bit. I think when you winch in, it'll drag you closer. Makes sense. But we're deep enough that the wire is not. I'm uh, coming up. Oh yeah, that's right. I keep forgetting we're facing south. I gotta remember that. It's important for my job. We need to calibrate the stick. Poor Ned. Hi. And Ed's on the drums today. All right, I think I'll stop the ship there. Roger. We're plenty far by the time you guys keep coming. Sounds good. Bridge, nav. Hold position, please. Yeah, we need to count. Thank you. Yeah. Need to count. Otherwise, we'll end up like a kilometer away from the mooring. Is that like a thousand meters? It's, uh, I don't know, I'm not really good at conversions. <laughs> <laughs> you need a newer calculator. Yeah, where's the calculator? Check one, two. So I think I have to just do one times a thousand. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's been that kind of morning. <laughs> How deep is the, the thing? It was only 800 above us like five minutes ago. Now it's at 500 meters depth, and we put it at the bottom, so it's probably 200 meters from the surface, right? The the, the ball is yeah, 200 yeah. from the surface. 250. 250. 251. Whatever it
So, Marley, lots of questions coming in about this ascent. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. So many. <laughs> no, but we did get a request to... Uh, it's so funny how Go back some, down. Of the, some of the viewers have like very specific requests for us. Yeah. Yeah. They would like to see uh, the hangar cam on SAT-3 once Herc is back up. I usually do that, actually. While well, they're telling you what to do. Right on. <laughs> I can just give them the IP address over here if they want to dial in and take over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's up? I'll go down and cook some proper bacon. <laughs> nice. Did, bring, did bring Mal and I read uh, this comment about, this was uh, like 30 minutes ago, but this person said, it's while it's certainly frustrating in the moment, I like seeing it when things don't go quite right. It's a reminder that even pros have issues, and it's all about how you work through it. There you go. So nice that they think that we're pros. I was just thinking, right. where's the pros? Yeah. <laughs> Must be on the other shift. What's going on with that radio? Yeah, what time did the pros get here? On the next cruise. Oh, you know, two ninety. Yeah, two ninety. I'm gonna, I'm gonna measure that. <laughs> I want to know what kind of math he's got back there. I see it. That sounds like the kind of guy who can multiply by a thousand easily. Yeah. <laughs> it is two hundred ninety-five meters. Yep, two ninety. What is he doing? Wow. How's Maybe he measuring that? He's got a range, that? range finder. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can't. Is it a range finder? Clearly, he's a golfer. He's looking at your screen. Yeah, just I, looking at it. Yeah, but I, it wasn't... <laughs> All right, Unless so that that guy's a better navigator, to just admit it. it. I can't, <laughs> I, no, I can't. I, I mean, maybe he went to Sonardyne and he switched it to... So maybe he should be doing the navigation? To range and bearing? No, there's no way. I'm out. I'm out of it. Yeah, get him up here. <laughs> you go run the deck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want my job? <laughs> Apparently he's a kilo navigator. Yeah. <laughs> kilo nav. Uh, in regards to that comment though, Marley, we, uh, we stream everything. I know, this poor viewer. I'm sorry, viewer. I haven't had coffee yet. <laughs> they were like, sorry, I'm not demanding anything. I was just requesting it, LOL. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> we got you covered. Yes, absolutely. We will put it on SAT3. We are happy to do that. I'm going to go get coffee so that I can be better at my job. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll put the mess cam on SAT3 so you can watch Marley get coffee. Yeah, these freaks would have cabin cams on if we, if they could do it. These freaks. <laughs> man, 1,800 meters. Oh, man. Comments.
Josh Dateo has attempted to create a salvo that did the entire monitor wall, just the way it is now, same boxes in the exact same places, but all filled with black. With black? Yeah, except maybe the shipboard cameras. It would look exactly like. Gold for Mexico at the minute. A, a rig in the Gulf of Mexico.
really? <laughs> yeah, those railies can really get you. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, I just came in, you know? I just yeah. walked into this. You come in and walked in. Sure All did. of a sudden, just instant depression. Yeah. Dep like, oh, remember, geez. I'm just waking no. up. You guys are halfway through yeah. your... Well, we can always get Mike up here. <laughs> yeah, get him. He does have a rangefinder. <laughs> he does have Trevor's a rangefinder. Trevor told finder. me. Yeah. He has a rangefinder. Yeah. I can't yell it loud enough. It wasn't even Mike's rangefinder, it was Trevor's rangefinder. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? Why does Trevor have a rangefinder on board? Um, to tell how well, far away. To know how far away stuff is. Let's uh, him know how far away Atlanta, Atlanta is on uh, launch and recovery. Yeah. And he uses it in the camera. He uses it up here. <laughs> <laughs> Still six yeah, feet. You, why were you back there? <laughs> you could just be in here yeah, doing it. Two that. meters. <laughs> Still two meters. <laughs> Still two meters. <laughs> <laughs> Video zoom wanting to zoom so you get closer to it. But it's yeah. still two meters. <laughs> two meters. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> Uh, all right, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. All right, Lucy, get, getting, getting warmed getting up. Loose. <laughs> getting loose. Whoa, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry, it'll, it'll self back off. The stick's calibrated. Hello, everyone. I'm back. With, With coffee. So With coffee. much yeah. happier. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Also, I just found out it's Nautilus's birthday. It is. I did not know that. 62? Yeah. 56. 56. Uh, I'm just throwing numbers out there. Cake made out of oil and grease. Still older than me. 56. Let's That's see. when the hull was laid. Was it built in Germany? No, no, this is 1967. That was it's, the it's hull. Old, it's it's older than sailed 56. in 68. The sign on the board in the mess says 56. Nobody's disputing it. Well, uh, Not even the boat. Sure. Yep. Okay. Do you hear anything more? Good. Yeah, no, I just can't see math. 56. That's the second math fail today. Oh, I should times by a thousand. It's 56,000 years old. <laughs> You're right, I should times it by a thousand. 56 kilo years. Yeah. You've got a real thing for this metric stuff, We just got a comment from a guy that said, well, guy or one. Person. After working on U.S. Navy subs for years, watching you guys working brings back fond memories of being in a control room. Nice. Yeah, except we're stretching out our legs. Yeah, yeah. and none yeah. of us are wearing pants. <laughs> <laughs> well, that doesn't. <laughs> same as on the sub. Yeah, yeah, that's not different. We oh, can right, that's the same. We can also walk outside and see the beautiful morning we're having here. The sun's yeah. out. It's so calm. Oh, no, don't the subs now have skylights? <laughs> we have uh, some, you know, I think it's submariners, but every time I say submariners or submariners, they always correct me to the opposite. So I'm just going to say it's one of the two. It should be submariners. Yeah, submariners. That's, that's what they say, but then they say... Right, but as soon as you say it to one of them, they go, no, it's they submariners. They go, no, it's submariners, because we're, because we know, it implies less than mariner. Just speak English properly. Yeah. <laughs> speaking, <laughs> speaking of not doing things properly, um, <laughs> they, say, they say that when, 
at least on U.S. subs, when they go down, they immediately switch over to 18-hour days. So they do six-hour watches. And I think they also have a four-day cycle, six on, too, six off. like ABCD yeah. watches. <laughs> yeah. they, they just, they just uh, oh, it's like six on, six off, six on, six off, but it's eight, so it's 18 hours, like, constantly. So their days are just completely messed up, which is strange because I, I thought that circadian rhythm was, like, slightly I, longer than I, 24 hours. I thought they did a different watch schedule each day for a four-day cycle and then repeated. Yeah, I don't know. If only somebody knew and could type there, in. I don't know. It just kind of seemed like when I was talking to them, I was like, it seems like you're just, you guys are out to make it harder. This very difficult thing that you're doing, living under, you know, in a small confined space. Like on boats, but on surface ships, you do, you do like four noon first. So you're on from eight in the morning till noon. Mm -hmm. On day A. And then the first watch is eight at night until mid midnight. Then you got afternoon middle, which is 12 till four. First dog, which is four till six, and the morning watch, which is four until eight a.m. Hmm. And then you get the last dog all night in, so Can't. six till eight at night, and then you're off for the rest of it. Can we just hold? Oh, that's a lot. Can we just do one year on, one year off? I mean, I think regardless of how you divvy it up, it's just about creating a consistent routine, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, it really doesn't matter how you chunk up the time as long as it's consistent. Yeah, it just kind of seemed like they had they had every opportunity to make it so you can get eight hours of sleep, and they're like, nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Never can. Nobody's Five. ever walked out of a sub and gone home, though, so they must like it. Hmm. 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 Makes you think, huh? Do an entire career there. Our director of data engineering is a, or data services is a former person who works on submarines. Nice. Yeah, Way to avoid one. the controversy. Yep. <laughs> Did he do it for a long time? I think quite a bit. Yeah, I mean, I know he got his dolphin, so yeah, qualified and then, uh, officer. And Val, who we work with from UNH, he's also. I think Submariner sounds cooler. Sure does. Yeah, I do too. Yes.